The first man to strike in an argument has lost ideas. He declined to sign the peace accord. It's been a war of words as the APC and PDP in Taraba State trade tackles over the attack on the APC governorship candidate's convoy in Wukari local government area of the state on Wednesday, the 17th of January, 2019. I've invited you here today to draw your attention and that of the general public in the growing desperation of Sanya Bakar Danladi, the gubernatorial candidate of the All Progressive Congress APC in Taraba State. To destabilize peace in the state, make the state ungovernable, and for the 2019 elections not to hold as scheduled. The Thursday, January 17, 2019, assault on Wukari by, by his gang of political talks, which he personally led, is the latest example of his desperation. We strongly believe that the attack on our convoy was poorly executed plan to kill our gubernatorial candidate, Alajisania Bakadanladi, whose car was directly hit and a bullet still lodged in the car. There is no doubt that Governor Darius Ishaku is already alarmed at the phenomenal growth of APC in the state within the last three years and the unassailing popularity of our candidate, Alajisania Bakadanladi. As both parties continue to engage each other, the Taraba state governor Ishaku is assuring Igbos in the state of adequate protection of their lives and property ahead of the general elections in the country. And I have agreed to stay put and cast their vote because our minds are now together. The mindset is we are going to see 2019 DDI return to the coming house again. In Yobe State, Governor Ibrahim Gaydam is asking the state's APC 2019 general elections campaign organization to work hard and ensure that the party wins the presidential, governorship and all other elections in the state. Our outstanding performance in the provision of the dividends of democracy gives us a clue as to who will vote for us and why. In recognition of the fact that women and youth from 80% of our voters. Our focus must be to target this 80%. As the campaigns heat up, politicians will continue to woo voters to swing the election in their favor.